I tell you, to everyone who has more will be given, but from the one who has not, even what he has will be taken away. This gospel today is familiar because we hear this in, after five days. Uh, we had similar gospel on Sunday. The Sunday gospel were com was coming from the gospel according to Matthew chapter 25, verse 14 to 30. And today's gospel is coming from the gospel according to Luke. There are similarities and there are a little bit differences in, in, in those gospels. But the thing is, Jesus is giving the parable of the king, giving his servants talents, money. In this gospel, Jesus says he gave them money to do business. And he didn't tell them how to do business. He called ten of his servants and gave them ten gold coins and told them, engage in trade with these until I return. And so I would like us to focus today on two things. On the trust of the nobleman to his servants and the reward given to those servants. On trust, he gave them his money. It, a lot of money by that time. And just say, do business. He trusted them. He trusted them. And he didn't even tell how to do business. Like, I want you to invest in this particular thing. Not at all. He trusted them, gave them, and then do business. And that is what God trusts us. He trusts us very much, given us various blessings and talents. And he doesn't tell us how to use them. Yes, the church sometimes tells us how to help the poor, how to help those in need. We have sometimes special collection, St. Peter's pens and others, but God wants us to use those talents he has given the way we, we can do. Some are not good in some, certain types of businesses. Some are good. So you and me today, God has trusted us, given us various gifts. He wants us to use those gifts the way we can. There I might not be direct direction to you and me to tell us how we can be good to others. That is in our ability. And second, reward given to those servants. The one who had ten more is given in charge of ten cities. The one who had five is given five cities. What does this tell us? Those who do good, more responsibility is given to them. When we are good in certain thing we do, God wants us to do more, not to relax. These, these people maybe could think, oh, now we've done a good job, then we're gonna just relax, eat and drink and marry enjoy life, not at all. He is giving them more responsibilities. And that is what God does to us. He wants us to use our talents even more. And to the one who didn't do anything, he is condemning him. Why? Because he hardly tried to keep it wrapped in the handkerchief and bring it back. When we don't use our talents, we would hardly keep them. And God wants us to do more. So today, let us reflect. How much are we using the talents God has given us? 
Do we know that God has trusted us very much? How can we bring back the trust he has given us? So let us pray today also for ourselves to always bring back the trust God has given us by using our talents.